Okay, we're here at Cooper Car 2019 on the Niviuk stand with Barney. Hey. Uh, we're going to have a, a quick chat about the Peak 5. So uh, the Peak 4, in my view, has been a pretty accessible two-liner, and I know a lot yeah. of people have used it to start that kind of road to fully competition gliders. Okay. The Peak 5 has some pretty uh, big boots to fill. Well, yeah, and um, what they've done this time with this glider, yeah, he's got some big boots to fill. Yeah. The glider has always been an accessible D yeah. with very good performance. But what they've done this time, they've used what they've learned from the Evox, right, okay. and they've brought that in. It's an accessible platform. Yeah, I mean, it's it, so the, the, the design brief is accessibility. But obviously there's a lot of competition out there and what we've got is not just a really good glider but an amazing glider that is almost as good as its mother, as the Evox. Almost as good. Very close. And yeah, very, very close. And what was important is to get that performance but keep that accessibility on a two-liner. So, okay, the Peak 4 you might say was a great training glider for hotter ones. This isn't a trainer glider at all. This is a maximum performance two liner. That's what we've got. So, yeah. and in a but in a still in a relatively accessible. Yeah, and so it, is it certified in D already or? Uh, so we st yeah yeah almost. It's going to be a D obviously. Yeah. That's the target um, audience. Yeah. But the design is more compact than the the, the Peak Four in the sense that it's more homogenous. The Peak 4 had this sort of sensation on the tips, yeah. which give a little bit of, it, it does give good feedback, but it also gives a little bit of uh, nervousness. Yeah, yeah. They've eliminated that, okay. um, but they've still got this tight brake pressure, yeah. um, compact design, homogenous throughout the span. And uh, yeah, I'm, I mean, I've done what, four or 500 hours on the Peak 4. Yeah. I'm really excited about it. I'm excited to test <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> Um, so in terms of stats, has the aspect ratio stayed the same? Have they elongated it a little bit? It's a little bit. So the Peak 4 was 6.8. This yeah. is 6.95. Very similar. Very, very similar. Um, the biggest difference <clears throat> when you speak to Tim, who's a designer, um, what they've done from, again, competition class gliders, this conversion of energy that we get when we're in moving air yeah. is to convert that into positive energy for the performance and that's what they've done with this glider Perfect. so that's what we've got look forward to trying it fantastic thank you very much